Hey guys! So today I am doing a video that I've been wanting to do for a while called Neostar came out with a video and he's called it the teddy bear tag. As soon as I saw the video I was like I have to do one. So I'm doing one. So anyway it's nine questions, oh, sorry ten questions but the last one is sort of like a free-for-all you can say whatever you want. Um, so the first question is blanket or bear? I have a bear. The second question is, what's his name? His name is Pinky. Now he doesn't look like very pink, but when I was a child, like when I when I got him, he was vera 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 pink. And yes, he's a boy. Don't ask me why a pink teddy bear is a boy called Pinky. But then again, I was a child and logic didn't quite come into the equation with the naming thing. Um, I have had Pinky ever since the day I was born, so just on 24 years now, because I turned 24 at the beginning of the month. Yay me! Um, biggest memory? I don't know if I could classify it as one memory, but whenever, whenever, whenever I was younger, well when I was younger, whenever I was upset, even now if I have a bad day, what I would do is I'd hold him to my chest like this, like squeeze him really, really tight and literally just bury my face in his head. So like here, it's very musty smelling, but it's collected up a lot of tears of a hormonal young woman experiencing life's traumas and general sadness. Well, I don't know. Um, dressed, I have kind of dressed him up, as you can see. When I was little, I used to put like my clothes and stuff on him, but he was too small at that point. When I actually, on the day I was born, when I got him, I was the same length. So I was as big as my teddy bear. Um, but clothing, my dad's mum, my nana, made him this. And I remember, because I, I remember the day actually very vividly, because I walked out into the lounge, or the kitchen, dining room. It's one big room in our house. And he was lying on the table, and mum was on the phone, with a measuring tape, measuring him. And I was so confused. And then about a week later, this arrived in the mail. It was really cool. He is missing a button. The top button did come off. Um, and it is all kind of stretched out to unrecognisable. At least the top bit is quite very baggy. But then again, it was baggy in the first place. Um, last time I washed him, I have no idea. Mum must have washed him when I was younger. Because knowing me, I probably would have tried to feed him something. Um, but I haven't washed him in a very, very long time because he is getting very patchy around the nose area where I used to kiss him all the, all the time. And yeah, I'm kind of worried. And around the ears a little bit as well, like on the seams. I'm kind of worried that if I do wash him, he's going to kind of fall apart. Um, I still sleep with him, like every night. He is still in one piece, relatively. Um, I'll just show you he did have like a little heart belly button thing that said I love you but for some weird reason I decided to chop it off so he has a belly button now and also when I was I used to hold his arm all the time so it's very floppy on that side like this bit here there's actually no fluff at all so he weighs a lot this cut side is a little bit so it's very floppy um, so yeah, he's still in relatively one piece. Mm. You can actually, I don't know if you can tell in this lighting, but the head is a lot more discoloured, faded, than the stomach area. It's still slight, it's like a very, very pale pink. This one's got more of a greyish tinge to it. But yeah. Um, and the last question, which is a free-for-all random fact. Um, he's gone to most places I have internationally. Um, I took him, I've taken him to Fiji, taken him to Australia, um, he's also gone with me to, oh, in, back in 2009 I did a big trip with my grandmother, my uncle and my cousin, we went to Israel and did a stopover in Thailand before going back to Perth for a holiday, um, so he's gone to Israel, Thailand and Perth as well, as well as the Gold Coast and where else has he gone? Oh, uh, Mackay. 
as well. So yes, he's he's a very he, he's not as well traveled as other teddy bears, I'm sure, but considering he's gone to as many places as I have, he's very well traveled. And he used to come up in road trips to um, up north to see the grandparents or wherever. Or so he's he's well traveled. Um, yeah. So thank you so much, Neo Star, for. I hope I'm saying your name right, by the way, for making this tag. It was a lot of fun to do, and I encourage everybody who's got either a blanket or a soft toy or a pillow to make this video because it's fun. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll talk to you later. Bye!